joining us. Um, you guys are still in Italy, eh? How's it, how's it going there? How was training today? That was good. Uh, yeah, we uh, got one more session tomorrow morning, uh, then we're leaving for uh, Swansea. So we are flying out tomorrow afternoon, but we're finishing our, our training on this side and then popping over. Weather still nice there, eh? Yeah, no, it's almost like summer here. Uh, obviously, a little bit different than Wales. So, um, yeah. but yeah, it's, it's great weather on this side. Cool, Dave. Uh, the review of the of the game on on Saturday. What did you guys learn? What are we What are we working on this week? Eh? Yeah, um, obviously happy with the result. Um, yeah, we we definitely wanted to go into the game with uh, one or two focus areas, which uh, defence was one of them. Um, we knew Zebra is quite a dangerous team. You know, if you give them opportunity. And we thought we really did well in that area. We shut them down, you know, we never felt like we were in trouble defensively. Um, so in terms of that great performance, obviously our other areas, um, yeah, they, there's, there's still a little bit of work for us. Uh, felt we didn't really get going like we wanted to, um, but it's, uh, it's probably just a function of how the game went. It was a little bit of a set-piece battle and a defensive battle. Yeah, I suppose also, um, just if you especially look at the back line, think about how... I think Marnie, Herschel, and Damien, the only guys who started the final, you know, quite a few new faces involved. So I wanted to ask Marnie, how, how's that going? How are the guys settling in with the kind of with the system that, that you guys play? Yeah, um, obviously, we, the guys are uh, settling in well. Um, yeah, we had like a good week um, of prep last weekend, uh, last week. Um, and yeah, we we, we um, work on our connections in um and getting to understand each other um, uh, more. And um, yeah, I just think it, it, it paid off um, on the weekend and the guys gel together nicely. So yeah. A guy like Alapati, how's it going with him? I mean, obviously he's got a lot of experience, but having to keep it to English, uh, I'm sure. Eh? Hey, sorry. <laughs> you have to speak English to him, man, eh? not Afrikaans, you saying. Yeah, yeah, no, I must, yeah, I must speak English um, right through the game um, now. Um, <laughs> they will always, they will also gonna, they will also um, well increase my English. Um, so yeah, now it's going good. Working with him, playing with him as well. Nice one, Moni. Okay, uh, see, Nathan's got his hand up, so Nathan, you can go for it. You just need to unmute yourself there, Nathan, and then ask your question. Eh? Sure, thanks, Mark. Can you accept any of that, eh? Uh, no, sorry, Mike, it's just breaking up. Yeah, yeah Nathan, we uh, didn't get a single thing there. Eh? Uh, the network squad. Um, Mike, Mike, I think I'm just going to rise. Soon, soon okay, cool. All right. Nice one. Okay. Stephen, your hands up. Go for it, Stephen. Thanks, Mikey. How's it, guys? Nice to see you. Um. Marnie, uh, with Sasha doing the uh, goal kicking um, this past weekend, um, did that in in a way um, take a little bit of pressure off you? Um, did you in, enjoy that because it looked like your, in terms of your own kicking, it was almost like flawless. Um, but um, Dobbo did mention that your knees a bit, uh, possibly a bit sore. But but how did you feel about that? Did you feel it takes pressure off you, or does it really make a difference? No, um, Stephanie, it doesn't really make a difference um, for me. Obviously, um, like, like Dobo said also, um, I have like a, a little niggle or soreness in the knee. Um, and I just thought it would be best for me um, to not kick in the game. And I, I was fully, I fully begged Sasa um, to do the job. And he, and he did a, a, he do a, a, a very well job. So he did very well. So yeah, um, no, it wasn't... Um, any sorts of taking the pressure off me it was just the case of um, maybe some a bit of soreness in the knee, but now it's all good now. So yeah. Stephen, did you have another question? Eh? Yeah. 
you still muted there, Stephen. No, I just I lost you guys. Sorry, um, okay. you guys froze for a while, um, a little bit on my on my screen. But um, yeah, I just lost you when Marnie was spoke about the soreness um, in his knee. Um, we wouldn't wouldn't mind elaborating on that. No, it's not. It's not um, serious, um, Stephen. It's not serious. It's just a bit of, um, especially last week. I have a bit. Uh, it was a bit uncomfortable. Um, but only a little bit, and I, I just thought I don't want to um, um, irritate it um, even even more by kicking in the game. Um, so, but for now, for now it's it's feeling um, very well, very good. So yeah, um, it's all good now. Um, Davi, um, can you just give your thoughts on the um, different options you have now? You know, Marnie's a uh, um, exceptional fly off and then you've got a guy like Sasha who clearly can also move into that position but um how do you feel now about the options is it suddenly something I know Sasha was there last year but this was a you know this past weekend's game was a massive one so how do you feel about him sort of getting giving you this option now that's great uh, Stephen I think um you know what we have is um at this stage we're building a little bit of depth um you know, especially Sasha, that's a youngster. You know, we we want to bleed him uh, and bring him through. Um, and it's great that he can play next to Marnie. You know, we uh, we like to have a, a inside centre that's almost like a second five eight. You know, that that has the same skill set. Um, so the same way we use Damien, uh, uh, yeah, in the season and last year in the URC. So him giving us that option and then you yeah, know learning from Marnie and then you know at, at a stage we'll probably have to step in that position uh, if we're going to give Marnie a bit of a breather. Um, but yeah, it's uh, it's great to have him there. Um, a guy like even like Kate played the weekend uh, yeah, against the Puma. So um, in terms of that position, uh, the future is looking bright. Yes. And your approach was very interesting. Um, you know, you spoke about the defensive. Um, you, know, you guys were very happy with the defence, but it's almost like you 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 know you brought a little bit of a variation into your normal approach, and it and it worked. Um, yeah, do, do, do you think that, that I know it wasn't a great performance as such, but that game maybe uh, should be seen in a very positive light, uh, give, given that you brought in a little bit of a different approach and it, and it worked for you? Yeah, no, definitely, Stephen. I think it's, like I said, very happy with the result. And we, we knew how we had to play in a certain way, not to allow uh, yeah, you know, that, that space. Um, and we, yeah, like you said, we sort of went into the game knowing what we had to do to win it. Um, and it's not always going to be pretty. You know, we're going to play at stages where the weather won't allow us to sort of play our natural game. Uh, we'd have to adapt to what the uh, opposition throws at us. Um, and yeah, we, it's, like you said, there's, there's a lot of positives out of that performance. I mentioned on, on Saturday night that Clayton would probably be coming up and Damien going home. Um, I'm not sure how things have turned out. Could you maybe just uh, please tell us about guys that have possibly gone home and then guys that are coming that have been drawn into the squad? Yeah, at, at this stage, um, you know, we're sending Herschel and um, Damien home. Um, you know, that's just the rest that they need to get in you know, after playing and being involved in the rugby championship and, and the test against Wales. Um, and then we're still just waiting on to see what's happening with uh, Chad. Uh, in terms of his bicep, but luckily JJ JJ went well this weekend against the Puma, so um, I think he's already almost on the plane coming over to us just for backup. And Clayton and Joseph? Yeah, sorry, Clayton Clayton at his wedding. Um, said he's going to do his honeymoon at a later stage, luckily, so uh, yeah, he's also on his way. And Dion, I take it, is with a box still? Uh, yes, so Dion. Again. Yeah, Dion, Dion is still resting. Um, yeah, he's, he's at home. Um, yeah, I mean, he, I think he had to reintroduce introduce himself to his, his little son yeah, after, after being away for about six months from home. But um, yeah, uh, we also just giving him a bit of a break because he had, a, had a, quite a tough run in the back end of the season. You can give some other guys a chance. <laughs> Thanks. <laughs> yeah, I know, but that's... that's it's great what's what's happening to us at the moment. You know, we've um, we've we've had qu with these quality players in the squad. You know, these um, guys that that wants the opportunity, they're getting the opportunity now to prove themselves, and um, uh, so far so good. Um, and yeah, it's that's just building up depth and it's building competition within the squad.
Cool, Stephen. I'm not sure if we lost you again there, but let's let's try someone else for now. We can come back to you. Uh, Mubin has got his hand up. Go for it, Mubin. Hi, good afternoon, um, Davi. Good afternoon, um, Mali. Um, Davi, uh, a lot was spoken about the tech, the attacking rhythm. Um, obviously, that's your department uh, with the tech in the back line. Um, how, how are you, what is your assessment so far of the tech um, on the side so far? And are you guys looking uh, this weekend to sort of get more attacking rhythm uh, going? Yeah, I think um, there's definitely... There was moments in those first two games which we were very happy with. It's almost felt like we just left off where, where we start, uh, ended last year. Uh, or, um, yeah, started where we left off uh, end of last year. So there were some great signs. Um, now we know how we want to play. Um, uh, and it is quite... Ex you know, we want to play expansive, exciting and, and allow players to, to express themselves. Um, this game against Zebra was a little bit different, um, but also we had a, a lot of new combinations, um, you know, especially in the backs. Um, you can ask Marnie, it takes a bit of time to just find each other, uh, you know, just to really get the timing right, to get the combinations right. Um, so, but yeah, looking to build on that uh, during this tour. And then um, just a question for Marnie. Uh, Marnie, uh, are you possibly looking forward to being called up the spring box um, for the end of your tour? Or is your mind not on that already? Um, well, deep, um, obviously my mind, my, my focus now is just, um, um, just in the storm, with, um, to be honest, um, obviously I just want to, uh, um, yeah, try to control what I can control and that's it, and that is to, um, you know, to, to do my best, to be my very best for, for the Stormers and for this jersey, um, and give my all for, for the Stormers and yeah, obviously then everything else will look after itself, but, um, yeah, it's, Obviously, it's for for a young guy growing up. It's always a dream. It's always my. It was always my dream. It's still my dream to play for the box um, one day. And um, and if the the chance come now, um, yeah, I will be grateful for it. You know. Um, but yeah, but for now, my like I said, my focus is is, is here now and and um, try to give to be my best um, and put put my the best performance out there what I can for the team. Okay, cool. Good luck, Tavi, uh, for the week preparation. And for Friday as well. Thank you. Thanks. Cool. Stephen, we can try again with you. Thanks, Mike. Can I shoot a few in Afrikaans, please? Yeah, of course. Okay, thanks. Amani, um, the one thing you have not the last few weeks, the scope of your work, but what the only thing you have to say that in the previous week you have done, is that your scope Jy weet, jy skop die bal baie diep uit nou, vir die, vir die lijnskoppe. Jy weet, vooral as jylle in die, in die kwaardgebied kan uh, ingaan en, en so, en is dit iets van jy specifiek gewerk het, net om daar, jy weet, die, die kwaliteit van jou uh, skopwerk uit die hand um, op jou baie hoog vlak te kry. Ja, Steven, dat is, dat is iets wat ek baie hard nog weer wil vallen in die precieze, um, ja, om, om om maximum um, distance te kry op my skoppe. Um, van alle kanten en toe van daar gee dan vir ons um, um, goeie opportunities om, om so, dit geef ons een goeie opportunity om so na, naast moendelik aan die, aan die opposition centraal lijn te kom en dan um, ja, om ons dan die, die best possible um, um, kans dan om te, om te score van aan af so maar ja, um, dit is iets wat ek, dat ek, wat ek hard aan gewerk is aan my kicking coach en ja, as jy het reed al wat hard aan gewerk en ek sit beleid dit betaal af nou ja Wat was jou ervaring um, om vir Sasha aan jou buitenkant te hee en um, in die mentorskap ook? Hoe, die, hoe, die die jylle, hoe, hoe was die jylle ervaring vir jou en wat is jou gedagtes oor, oor Sasha? Nee, ek is, ek is het blij vir Sasha, ek is baie blij vir Sasha um, met, sy, met sy vertooning. Um, die naweek, ja, ek denk hy was, hy was, hy was baie goed gewees um, um, en ja, hy het goeie jylle door gespeel. Um, En, en ons het lekker saam, saam um, ons het lekker saam ons speel ook, um, om eerlijk te wees um, en ja, ek is maar net, so ek sê, ek, ek is maar net blij vir hom, um, vir die, vir die vertooning wat hy opgesit het en, en hoe hy, hoe hy, hoe hy um, sy kant gebring het vir die team en, um, en ja, ek, ek heb obviously vir my, ek moet gehad, hy moet net om sê al wees en soos daar wees sê um, wat, is wat is wat ons kultuur um, bied is vir, is vir jong spelers en vir ons allemaal hier om ons, om ons 
um ay taka na pa itino sa kan kan itino sa ino sa talento taka pa isa pa ito ano yah ito mleka rugby to school so yah maakas sa sekse kasi pa yung platform for si futuro ng tulpa sila yah that um spanay yah sa biki fine na dopa um diri sa sun sa kaya ali magic pa tayo kamaakit ni fura kasi sa sun serbia sorry sorry Stephen serbia Um, vind jy dat spanne jou een bykie meer um, doop hou, in termen van die verdediging op jou, um, na, jy weet nou al, al jou vaardighede wat jy verlede seizoen ten toon gestel het, is hulle baie vinniger op jou hierdie seizoen, nou wil jou, voel jy dat jy jou meer doop hou? Ja, ek denk, ja, um, ja, spanne, ek, ja, ek denk hulle, hulle hou my meer doop, um, ja, hulle hou my meer doop, um, maar, Voor mij ik focus je focus je op wel en ik focus op mijn mijn voorbereiding en mijn voorbereiding geeft mijn confidence en en ja en ik ga niet uit ja binnenweg en ik ga execute die voet dus die die space dat voor mij is die pixels dat voor mij is ik ga execute dat en ja maar ja maar ik 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 voel een beetje hit er komt voor mij maar ja is is ook goeie is goeie hit wat 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 ik likes ik likes ik likes Ek hou, ek hou van het, ek hou van die preze wat er onder sit, en so, so ja, is lekker. Mani, jy het nou ook sikke bal vergeet, hoe dit voel om te verloor, jy het trek nou al op 14 aan wene in een rij, het jy een specifieke, is dit iets waar jy het praat, en een specifieke, voel jy lijn die druk daarvan, en is daar een specifieke, jy weet hoeveel van die gesprekspunt is dit in die span? Sorry, boys. It's definitely not load shedding on the side, but um, the Wi-Fi just dropped. Thanks, Dave. Leave it on the Italian Wi-Fi. Yeah? Yeah. <laughs> cool. Um, I'm not sure where we got to. Morning. I, would, I just asked about the um, you know 14 wins in a row now, right. and and uh, just just how the team feels about that, and whether they. Uh, feeling a bit of pressure and or, or is it really not just not an issue no Stephen, we um we yeah, obviously for, for us um we we focus uh, the, the thing that we get that i like i said um we we um focus quickly on the next job in the next um, on the next game um whatever like i guess what, whatever happens in the past that happened but um we're not we're not um hanging too much around um, the result that, that we got on the on the on the week and yes we we celebrated it um but um the ability for us um i think to get to zero and and and, and start preparing for the next job um i think we we um we we get there right at the moment um and yeah 
it's it's yeah. Did, did you have any? Cool, nice one. Okay, Dylan, you got your, your next. Thanks, Mark. Um, just a question for Darvi, um, please. Hi, guys. Hope you both well on um, that side. Um, Darvi, just in terms of giving these guys like um, Sasha and Suleiman, and all these young guys, an opportunity, it must be good, especially with the season. It's going to get quite busy later on this year with the European Champions Cup coming up. So it must be good to give these youngsters an opportunity and still get the win at the same time. <clears throat> yeah, no, it's great. I think it's... Um... So it's, it's, it's really exciting for us as a squad, you know, it's um, you know, those players coming through um, yeah, and it's guys for the future as well, you know, not just thinking of this season, it's, it's thinking ahead um, a season or two time where these guys will have a lot of caps under the belt and they uh, they will be great players for the Stormers going forward. So uh, obviously the youth always brings a bit of energy, so uh, it's great having them around and um, yeah, I think guys like Marnie, um, yeah, our senior players are doing a great job also helping them, you know, guiding them with um, how we want to play and, and and what's important for us as a group. So um, yeah, I think all, everyone's benefiting at the moment from it. All right, nice one. Uh, Dylan, that question was pretty much exactly what Nathan was trying to ask at the start. So we covered there. That's perfect. Uh, Adnan is next. Go for it, Adnan. Hey, thanks, Mike. Um, how's it, Davi and, and uh, Mani? Davi, just a question for you. Um, on, on Saturday, I asked Robert the same question and he agreed with me. He said that, I mean, um, there were times where uh, the guys had penalty advantage and uh, they kicked it away um, on attack. Um, is that something that you guys obviously will look at for this weekend? Um, yeah, no, no, I think it's... We will never really kick a ball away just for the sake of kicking it. You know, um, uh, if we kick it, we, yeah, we obviously there's space facing behind. Um, might sometimes overcook the kick or uh, kick into you know, the wrong you know, part of where we wanted to aim for. But um, you know, it's, it's never in our DNA or in our mindset um, just to to give the ball away. We definitely have a certain uh, way we want to kick uh, and execute it. So yeah, even if we have space, um, you know, Wherever we can find it, we'll, we'll go for that. Doesn't matter what, uh, you know, if it's an advantage or not. Yeah, and um, you, um, Dylan mentioned the youngsters now. The, the fact that Herschel is going back, um, <clears throat> you obviously have um, Paul still there, and uh, I'm not sure, is, is he Mark Khan with on tour? No, it's uh, Godlin is uh, with us. Uh, he might play it for the province 15 team uh, against Pumas on Sunday. Yeah. Yeah, so obviously you you can fall back to Godlin um, as an option. Yeah. 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 And then, then just for, for Mani, um, you mentioned earlier on that was asked uh, obviously about the Springbok aspirations. Mani, I would like to give an African word, as I believe. Okay, I was a lot of these players, but they are falling and so on. Thank you. With uh, the dispelsive and the storm is pass your fire foot. As you before built up a word flag for the poker or spill, don't you that that that's how you shall sit there and pass them and you spell with Mark many many years with the poker spill. Yeah, I know. Um, I um, yeah, I can eat me. I can eat. I can eat the way you want to spill with the with the um with the storm is when that the loud my young. Om myself te wees en ook om my, om my skillset um, um, daar buiten te sit verstaan um, en die keim en so. So ek is, ek, ja, ek like so hoe ons speel en ja, as, as, obvious as ek nou, as ek nou, ja, as ek weet, as ek nou hoor moet wil, wil speel, um, sal ek, sal ek, um, ja, moet seker maak dat die basis ja, deel van my keim is on point, soos my kicking, um, wet kicking, to pause kicking, tactical kicking, um, my, my passing game um, and, and all the other things game management um, so I'm going to be able to do on my flag to well, well, um, um, yeah, on my flag to well, as I go by flag now we'll spill so on. So yeah. Yeah, it, with a new scope back, your, your scope back for last week was very, very good um, and the foul in the previous week straight. So I have a lot of questions to make uh, with Gareth uh, and your, and your technique, when it, it, it likes to see your rhythm, but you're good, and you're in the call with all your scope. 
يعني هيك صار معكم الواقع بس ما 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 سكوب ما سكوب غير وبيقوم لك ما يسوي ما يرد ما يرد ماس بس هو تكس تكس تراجي بوليكا هيك صار معكم لك ما يبرد سوا إن ده سدنا وافن بعانق عرض سوزك سوزك فورنا سير ده سدنا وعاق عرض ده بيعرف كتني بريسيشن أم أم تاعي تيب تاع أم أي أم دهنا أم أي بوكسيس تي كرون تو ماي رتم ماي ماي أم ماي بيلانس ماي ماي ويجي بول أبروتش ماي سترايك إن ألس دي أم يتك بيلا كارت ده بيعرف كني إنك دهنا كت بتاعنا وف أم إنك يا كريت كريت نو كريت ريخ أبغوم لك سوا سو يا شو كذا ما بقوله Yeah, thank you. Thanks. Cool. Dave, are you going to tell Gareth you got credit there or maybe just don't let him know? Yeah. Just uh, uh, this is this one, Gareth. You're doing a good job. Yeah. I would say um, I'm laughing a lot. I was crying for Marnie and Gareth from a car off here. But I was the best welcome to the other year when Marnie spoke to us. So, yeah, I love that. Uh, yeah, Gareth did a great job, and I'm a big money to talk here, and but uh, we're going to look at the scene and very good also. Yeah, I was just Sasha, um, I've seen it, but in um, I'm like a tear in his panties, it's not going to look like phones. Nice one. Uh, okay, Stephen, you still got your hand up. I don't know if you've got another question or not. Yeah, sorry, Mike. Uh, yeah, I'll be a little bit of silly last to this, but if I may wear, um. Ek wil net by jou, ek wil net graag jou persepsie kry oor die Aspreys, die vraag nog nie juist mense onderskat, of ek weet nie of dit onderskat is nie, maar daar is die persepsie dat die Walliese spanne nie tans rarig op peil is nie, ek het net gewonder of jy jou gedagtes daar oor kan gee, asjeblieft. Ja, nee, ek bedoel, ons weet as we gaan een tabbe wedstrijd wees, vrijdag het Osbris het die Walliese skuld gewen laas jaar, en is al het goed gedoen daar so, denk hulle performance is betekker inconsistent, maar ons weet by die huis is hulle baie moeilike span en hulle het baie ervaring ook in hulle span, en weet hulle is Alan Jones, George North, ons het groot toets rekwe gespeel het, het is een span wat jou onder druk kan sit, as jy nie goed is nie kan recht, as jy jy goed nie recht nie, so ja, ons bereid voor vir een tabbe wedstrijd, omstandighede gaan een klein bykie anders te wees as waar ons gespeel het die laaste ruk, so ja, ons weet het, ons moet op ons beste wees saad vrijdag aan, sorry. Baie dankie julle, lekker dwein. Nice one guys, thanks so much for your time, man. All the best, safe travels. Bye bye. Bye bye, thank you. Bye bye.